My name is Terry Ellis. I'm an independent audio reviewer from the YouTube channel and website Pursuit Perfect System. And Elite Audio UK have asked me to take a look at a product that they are really excited to be offering to their customers, the Metrum Acoustics Metrum Onyx DAC. A DAC that had a few surprises in store for me. Are you wearing gold? Metrum Acoustics are a Netherlands-based hi-fi manufacturer that have been in business for over 15 years. The Metrum Onyx sits in the middle of the Metrum Acoustics hi-fi DAC range. And it is exclusively a DAC, a standalone digital to analog converter. Metrum Acoustics also make the Jade, which has the same DAC as the Onyx, but also features pre-amplification for a slightly higher cost. The Onyx is for an audiophile who already has their digital music source, their pre-amplification and their amplification in place. The Metrum Onyx has various digital inputs, as you might expect, such as USB, RCA-based SPDIF, optical and balanced. AES, and you can have an I2S and an MQA board added for an additional premium. For analog outputs, there are both RCA and balanced options, which is perfect. Setup is nice and easy. The Onyx has a nice faceplate with easy to read labels and big LED indicators for each input, which you're definitely not going to miss, even if you sit at a distance. The Onyx does come with a clicker type of remote control for cycling between the different inputs, and it's made from aluminium, which is a nice touch. Priced at £2,399, the Metrum Onyx sits very much in between two key price categories for DACs, such as the under £2,000 price category and the £4,000 and above. And that was one of the surprises for me, its performance in relation to its price. And I was very lucky to have three other Hi-Fi DACs here to compare with the Onyx. And that was actually very important for me to work out what the Onyx is doing and what it can do. But before we get into that, what is the Metrum Onyx and why is it special? The Metrum Onyx is a balanced non-oversampling DAC, but that title doesn't really do it full justice. To really work out what's going on here, we need to look inside. Metrum Acoustics have developed their transient DAC to chip module, which is an R2R ladder network that was designed for their flagship DAC, the Pavan. And as you can see in the Onyx, it features four of these, or really two per channel that work in parallel and have an FPGA control in them. This works to divide the sound signal so that each DAC2 module is working in its most linear range. And this creates a fully balanced dual mono DAC design with 24 bits of dynamic range, 120 decibels of channel separation and other cool statistics like minus 145 decibels of dynamic range. I have never seen a DAC designed like this before and it definitely didn't sound like how I expected it to. I think I was expecting the Onyx to sound softer and maybe overly smooth, but that's definitely not the sound that it creates. It creates a big sound, a big solid sound with a nice wide sound stage with lots of detail packed into that sound stage. There's real drive and energy behind the music and there is a nice solid and full bass. And this aspect really reminded me of maybe chip DAX or maybe FPGA based 
DAC. However, when you compare to that type of DAC, you will notice that there is a smoothness and a gracefulness behind some of the aspects of the Onyx's musical delivery that is different, that is stand out different to those types of DACs. And you'll definitely notice this in the mid-range and the treble delivery. The Onyx maybe sounds a little bit less focused, but it's definitely more relaxed and easygoing overall and relaxed and easy going only to a point but not to the point where the music becomes softened at all. The overall timing is maybe not quite as crisp but it's very very close but again you will notice that more smooth and relaxed mid-range and treble which makes music probably a little bit easier to listen to and definitely less tense. Vocals sound nice and instruments sound nice. And there is a little bit of a gloss to how the Metrum Onyx presents music, but definitely for the betterment. Not quite tube or valve gloss like, but maybe just a little bit. Comparing to an R2R and an FPGA DAC in the sub 1200 pound price category, you can very clearly and instantly hear what the Metrum Onyx is offering over and above those DACs. It creates a sound with a wider and better, more clearly defined soundstage with more energy and drive to the music, better and more solid and full and substantial bass, a more full sound overall. It's more focused, more refined, definitely smoother, nicer and easier to listen to. And when you do those comparisons, you can clearly hear why the Onyx or how the Onyx justifies its £2,399 price tag because it is very clearly the next step on. And I think you will notice and appreciate its fullness of sound, its nicely textured sound, and its nice combination and mixture of smoothness, but still with immediacy. There is also the possibility to upgrade your Metrum Onyx DAC as Metrum Acoustics develop new technologies. And looking at the website, they are already working on a version three of their transient DAC modules. I would admit the Metrum Onyx has made me very interested to hear the flagship DAC, the Pavan and other products from Metrum Acoustics. And if you are feeling the same as me, which wouldn't surprise me, my advice is speak to the team at Elite Audio to find out more information and arrange a demo for yourself. I hope you found this product focused video useful and interesting. And if you'd like to see more, make sure you subscribe to the Elite Audio YouTube channel so that you don't miss out and obviously hit the thumbs up button as well. If you'd like to see more detailed in-depth reviews, come on over and see me at Pursuit of Perfect System. I do a lot of that on my YouTube channel. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Thanks very much for watching. I'll see you soon and stay safe.